Oi, 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 oi. Try it. <laughs> what banks do. <laughs> Did one get a bit excited? Yes. Are you in? He's in! He's got one! He's got one on the worm! He's <laughs> and he's landing it! <laughs> He didn't even know he had one. Kiss my ass, yeah. Nancy. <laughs> oh man. That's the coat. I even give him the worm. <laughs> it's a species though, and that's 2-1. You're high, in the game. You're in the game. High six. <laughs> one hour rod challenge. That's now 2-1. <laughs> Let's get him back. He'll be a six pounder one day. Well, we are officially halfway through. I have lost about, I don't know, a kilo and a half in sweat, Spud. Four kilos. <laughs> <laughs> oh, two one. Yeah, two one. Paku, well, what are you after now? Call it. Paku, cool. it's got to be a Paku on Amazon Red, really, on fish head. That's it, and I, on, I need a Michael carp, a little Mekong, um, well, I think a little Mekong might take me to, to be on the end of the match, in fairness. <laughs> or I need to do something with my rig to try and catch a little tilapia, because I think three, the way it's going, might win it. Even though there's, what, 15 or 16 different species in here? Something like that? Yeah, there's a few. Giant snakeheads. I've had a big one out of here before. I've had a big one, but it wasn't a snakehead. It was a girl from Romford. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mate, you're in trouble if this is a Michael Carp. Michael carp, he's like the grass carp. Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that! Savage! Oh, it's, oh no, it just came back. <laughs> I think it's, it's melting my reel. <laughs> that is oh, blimey. Oh, I don't know, mate. Them, well, the Julians are going off like that, ain't they? Yeah, they are, yeah. Oh, oh, <laughs> we're gone then. I'm not being funny, but it took 40 yards in two seconds to come back to me, right in the edge. It went back out to the other side of the lake, and now it looks coming back like I can't keep. The speed of these things, you just. Look, it seems stupid, doesn't it? It's just coming right at me. This is the sort of speed it's taking line at, though, isn't it? Yeah, it's right in the edge now, it's smoking on. <laughs> Doesn't happen anywhere else in the world. This is stupid. It's hard. Hey. Another Julian. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'm not being funny, I target him on the big lake. If I work a 40 pounder like that, I don't think I've got the business to, to tame him. Oh. Oh. Look at that. Can you believe some so small we've done that to me? You believe that? Can you believe all of that was from a fish about five pounds? Six pounds, maybe seven pounds, I don't know. But it ain't big, and it just run me the length of this lake three times. Look at that. What an absolute stunning creature. These are fast becoming my favorite species on the entire planet over, I reluctantly say, the giant Siamese carp. But this is supposed to be the baby lake, and on this light gear, they run you as hard and as ragged as the monsters, 200, 300, 400 pounders on the other lake. It's spectacular. Stuart has created one hell of a fishery. And I don't like getting on a plane, I really don't. But I tell you, I fly over here every single year with a missus for two weeks of this mad action. Because it just don't get better anywhere on the planet. Don't. It don't get better. Look at that. Holy moly! So if you look over the other side of the lake, there's a lovely little couple from Southend. She's lovingly come over here to let her husband fish what a for nice a couple of hours a day. He brings her up here and she gets bent into fish as well. It's a lovely little family. Fun lake this is. Oh dear! Even though I might be making it look <laughs> a little bit less fun than it should be.
<laughs> Jesus Christ, I can't keep up it. This has almost certainly got to be another Julian's because the speed of it is moving so fast. This is like a common car on steroids, crossed with Usain Bolt and a rocket up its arse. It's amazing. And believe it or not, there are little 20 pound Mekongs in here as well. I'd love to have a little 20 pound Mekong. You know what it might be? A motor pike and side cup. <laughs> oh, I'm yet to meet anyone that don't like that man. Ooh, Ooh that got me. Another packer, mate, all your packer that you fed over there this morning. Yeah. I've gone over there. <laughs> They're all full of food. They've got naffed off me. Keep catching them. The Paku Whisperer. Well, I'll tell you what, mate. Shall we call this last fish and then go and get some grub? I think you're right. Because I'm Ank Marvin and, and I'm uh, sweating hot. Yeah. To be honest with on... you, I know it's only 2-1. That's not a lot of species. There's well over 15 species in this place. But See, in England, it's rain stop play. In Thailand, it's sun stop play. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but realistically, you was expecting red towels, arowana, paku, oh bloody hell, it's gone through the fire sink, let's concentrate. I could have caught little Mekongs, Migal carp. It's, it's ridiculous the amount of species that are in here that you can catch in it, really. Yeah. And the tilapia, that little one that you had, oh, I think it's a paku. Yeah. It might be a bigger net. That tilapia that you had have got a four pound, didn't they? Yeah, a bigger six. Bigger? Yeah. My friend Casper the Friendly Ghost had one. Is that a Julian's? I don't know, I thought it was a packet. How come? I'm not that wrong. No, it's a little, it's a little, no way. it's a little Siamese carp. No way. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I didn't even mention Siamese carp, I didn't know they were in here. Yeah, yeah, no, that's worth having now, isn't it? Oh mate, that is going to be nailing the coffin, isn't it? <laughs> off, 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 off. Oh no, don't say that. <laughs> You'll feel really bad if I lose this now. No, I won't. The tiny little baby giant Siamese carp in the main lake, I've caught these to 108 pounds. And this might not even be eight pounds. This is amazing. You don't see these that small. They've purposely stopped them in here, tiny. I mean, it's just, you never ever catch Siamese carp of this size on the main lake. Oh my God. This has turned out. Oh yes, go on, please, please. Oh, oh couldn't, did, do, couldn't do anything with that. Go on, mate, that's right. Oh, look at that. That has made my day. That has made my day. I don't care about winning or losing. That is, mate. <laughs> it was his idea to come up here and have a little fish off. Unfortunately, the fish baits didn't work. But do you know what? You don't have to be on the big lake to have a whale of a time. That has made my that has made my trip. <laughs> there we go. That's probably 20 pound of giant Siamese carps. Not a giant yet, but they're well over 130 pound in the big lake. In my favourite global species, soon to be overtaken by the Julian's prize carp, but. That is the nail in the coffin. 3-1. We're going to go for some grub. But I've got to be honest, I didn't even think they were in here. Spud, <laughs> yeah, it's your idea to come up here. Yeah, nice. It's been an absolute blinding one hour's fishing. There's up to 15 odd species, probably more, I can't list them, that you can catch in here. And the truth of the matter is, you have to look after them. You're not allowed to take them out of the water in the big lake, but you are here because they're slightly smaller. But if you think that you've got enough to take on the spug, get yourself <laughs> over to Gillam's and have a word with this man. Awesome, what a day, Excellent. what an hour. Yeah, what an hour. <laughs>